Hello guys, uh, DAWs is the topic today and we're trying to build us a home studio. So a lot of you guys get fear about starting your own home studio. And I do, I'm do. i doing this because uh, I'm trying to get people who are in the working class uh, area to be more uh, knowledge about the digital audio recording and how easy it is it's one of the easiest things you'll ever do and a lot of you are great guitars but you're afraid to get into the digital audio world and i'm sure some of you get still got eight track uh digital recorders uh yeah, i'm sure some of you got four track digital recorders where you record your guitar or something like this but let's step up let's go a little bit further let's go into a digital audio workstation that goes straight into your computer Something I use is, of course, an M Audio box, and you can get these uh, anywhere from eBay. You can get these online, and you can get these anywhere eBay, Amazon, uh, wherever great products are sold. Now, this is a M box, and of course, this is what I use is an M Audio box, not this one in particular. I have my own that I use. And, of course, I use it with Pro Tools because that's what I've learned and I've used over the years. And I'm very satisfied with what I have. And I have an old philosophy. If it's not fixed, don't break it. I'm also looking into other recording software as well. But I like this the style and look. One thing I like about Presonus, and we'll go over Presonus, is they have all the plugins up front. Something that I would uh, recommend that, that you look at when you are looking at a digital audio workstation so so I don't know what the best way to call it to try to ease your fears about it because it is like I said I've been doing this for many many years I switched over from analog well I mean I had digital mixing boards like you probably do with a, a little bit of the hard drive in the back but then I switched over to the computer and I've never looked back and one of the reasons is because it is financially uh, you know lower on the uh, pocketbook uh, you don't have to spend so much you know great programs have replaced uh, great devices that uh, which we'll get into the plugins as well but I'm not really a plug-in person I don't download the latest plugin all the time because I believe you know if you're a good musicians you don't have to rely on devices and plugins. You just have to make great music. And some of you that record acoustically, you understand that. But that's what a microphone is all about to replace, uh, you know, to record, you know, that good music that you play, whether it's mountain music, bluegrass, or uh, even the digital music like I record. All right, so uh, let's, let's just dive into uh, digital audio workstations and some that you can get for under $500. And uh, let me explain what a D DAW is. A digital audio workstation is basically a device that is compatible with the music software that you have for your computer to record. So as far as software that's what you're going to have to decide and i'm going to give my opinion these are my opinion and you guys can comment below because whatever works for you is what works for you i use pro tools why because it's what i worked in when i was going to school to learn to be a digital audio recording engineer i use pro tools that's that's the staple of the industry that's what I still use today because if it's not broken don't fix it I now if I was started now I would not start with Pro Tools I will say this okay if you are a Apple user if you are a Apple user that's fine if you got the money if uh, you probably drive a Mercedes too but if you are a Apple user I would recommend sticking with Pro Tools Keeping the M audios because it's fine. It works. They Apple and Pro Tools are just the perfect marriage. It's like a, a man and a woman going down the aisle. That's what Pro Tools and M audio boxes are great. If you're Apple, if you are a 
Windows person. Now, understand if you are a Windows person, let me understand. You know uh, if you're with Safari, you've got an Apple. If you are found this video through Safari, you've got an Apple. If you've got Internet Explorer, you've got a Windows. But you can download Google and you can download Safari for your computer. It doesn't matter, uh, you know, which, uh, you know, format you use. But if you're a Windows person, there's so much software out there that is makes the uh, compatibility of sound perfect because that's what it is about the sound uh, from Reason to Appleton to Cubase uh, native all that software is perfect for Windows and you got and the thing is about it, it's the perfect price DAWs for Windows are at the perfect price with the perfect software I cannot say that enough and there's such great you get down to the under 500 range and that's where we're at right now guys M audio Apple that was the the thing of the past you guys when I you know that's what you had to get and uh, you're talking about spending 2500 I mean or to three thousand dollars worth of good equipment from uh, speakers and we'll get into speakers later because we're going to build us a good studio and you can do it pretty practically for under five hundred dollars yeah that sounds great all right so let's go into our workstations i'm going to go into five of them that i would recommend if you don't want to spend over two hundred dollars and I've oh wow we've got the price on here except for one <laughs> of course I would always forget to put one on there but you can look at the links below and I'll try to attach the pricing uh, you know on a uh, title card or something like that okay so let's start out with the pre Audiobox audio box USB 96 2 by 2 USB audio interface with a Studio One Artist in Appleton Live Light DAW recording software, $99. Now, Presonus, I'll go into later. I like their equipment. Would you have to replace it? Uh, probably more often than, say, a lot of the other DAWs or other equipment out there. You know, it depends how rough you are. And this recording software with the DAW is $99. Getting microphones, we'll go into that later. Uh, the next one I would recommend is, of course, or highly recommend, if I was starting over again today, I would get the Focusrite Scarlett Solo third generation USB audio interface with Pro Tools first for $119 and of course you download Pro Tools first would I use Pro Tools with it today I don't think so I would probably go with something like maybe reason or something like that today and of course this is highly recommended if you're a Windows person I am not going to talk about you Apple people stick with Pro Tools you're fine you're gonna be doing wonderful with that software and with the M audio devices Donner audio interface live jack light 2 in 1 2 out USB audio interface uh, with a TRS balance with headphone amplifier and audio what do I recommend this one says it has about three different uh, you know uses of uh, software uh, you know I don't even see what the software use but that's another thing issue too you need to do your research on what these use and this is just a cheaper interface and then of course the Steinberg UR22 Mark II channel USB interface and I brought up Steinberg because Steinberg makes some great plugins and they make some great software for recording now the Steinberg UR22 Mark II channel USB interface uh, usually goes with Cubase AI or Cubase LE and guys it's a, one that a lot of people use with their Windows format 
and this runs you about 164.99 or you say 165 dollars of course if you want to be a real cheapy say if you're just doing a podcast and just want some decent uh, software for podcasts uh, that you can get online and use a pretty decent uh, DAW a Behringer UM2 Plus XLR mic cable Euphoria audio interface uh, Zen YX mic preamp is $69 so there you go guys those are some devices you can utilize along with your uh, recording software so with the DAWs it's going to be all about the your first research is go on YouTube and look up these software or look up these DAWs and then look at the software that they go along with it I'm going to say 99% of the time you're going to be satisfied with the software that comes with the digital audio workstation. So uh, just keep in mind. Thank you. God bless. Have a wonderful day. Who's your daddy? Having issues distributing your music? Try DistroKid today. Get your music distributed through Spotify, through iTunes, Pandora. TikTok, through YouTube, through Twitch, all by clicking below. Click on the link below and try DistroKid to get your music distributed today. I've tried it and I've loved it.